Christopher H. Barr Memorial Wildlife Museum. This is a barber my dad would take me to uh, in Point Pleasant, West Virginia. He donated the money to have this building built after he died to hold his collection. Everything in here is what he collected. He was a hunter. He traveled not only over the country, but all over the world to hunt. We're going to show you some of his taxidermy, and then we're going to show you his gun collection. There he is, straight ahead. What's up there? What's up there? That he got in 2003. So that was toward the end of his active life. You know, even if you're not into hunting or taxidermy, I'm not a hunter, guys, but I respect it. Where's that buffalo? Just don't realize, I mean, you, you realize, I guess, but until you see a head of a moose, you realize how big they are. Jeez. An elk. Okay. This is his lifelong gun collection that he donated here to for us all to look at until eternity. A lot of cool pieces in here. I like the handguns and the knives. I'm gonna show you here in a little bit, a little better, but there's a lot of cool, old, valuable guns in this place. And they have security big time here, cameras and guards and everything. when they're closed in the evening. Just for my thieving viewers, don't get no ideas. <laughs> I'm sure none of you that way. I'm just joking. Well, let's lose hope, right guys? Some of his part of his little collection, his billfold. Here's a picture of him as a young man. Here's a picture of Rugs. It looks like his first car with 1950 snow car, I'm thinking. That he actually wore. That's how he looked when I did him. Definitely a case knife collector. I can see that. Some very old valuable cases in here, guys. It's very cool to look at. New Hampshire, Virginia. Did a series where they did states, I guess. It's pretty cool. Into his pistols. Yeah. 
Even if you're not into this stuff, you gotta respect the guy with these old, I mean, these are guns from the 1800s, guys. Black powder guns, you know, the Frank Lopo gun, Colt black powder. Uh, looks like they might all be Colt black powder. There's a Sam Colt from New York, Sam Colt New York gun. Double barrel hammer. Remington, 1868. The LCD bolt, 38 caliber. Look at that little 32 caliber. Mini muzzle loader. I thank you, sir, for your lifelong collection. Your passion and sharing it with everyone. He was working on this to do this. I know the last 10 or 15 years of his life want to make some kind of museum of his stuff when he died. And uh, I truly respect that. Maybe when I die, you know, I'll have a junk car museum, you know. You can come and see every junk car I own. <laughs> I appreciate you guys. I really do. You know the routine. It'd be a boring world if we was all the same. Keep being you. Get out there, do something, follow passion. Just explore. Have fun. Like I do. Later guys and gals.